Metal Slug. The Neo Geo had an incredibly long life. People don't realize that it's actually the second longest, most supported platform just behind the Atari. Yes, it lasted for decades and was home to some truly superb video games. Everyone knows the King of Fighters, but I would argue that of all the video games to get released on the platform, Metal Slug is arguably the most popular franchise that SNK released. It seems like everyone knows of this Nazca classic. Originally released in 1996, the series would continue through Metal Slug Double X, which was released in 2009-2010 depending on your location. After Double X, the series would move on to mobile platforms where it has remained ever since. However, the core gameplay is now radically different. All of us are dying for Metal Slug 8. But today, let's go back in time and discuss what makes Metal Slug so damn good. To start off, let's talk about the one and only negative in the whole game. You can't fire diagonally. This has always been what separates Metal Slug from Contra and many other run-and-gun shooters. Originally designed this way to encourage players to locate different weapons, which do grant partial diagonal shooting. The biggest help of all being the Metal Slug, a vehicle that allows you to shoot in 360 degrees. It certainly takes some getting used to, but the overall tight controls and incredible level design more than make up for this potential shortcoming. And I say potential because not all of us thought it was a shortcoming. Speaking of design, Metal Slug is an incredible looking and sounding video game. And it's why people continue to discuss it to this very day. There's a reason why there are seven mainline entries in the series, with several enhanced versions of the numbered entries, and then a buttload of spin-off games. People love this universe and the incredible graphics. The animations are superb, the attention to detail in every single frame is incredible. From the way enemies die, to the way flags move in the breeze, there's something to look at in every possible scene. I've always had an affinity for the original Metal Slug myself. Its design is so sharp that slowdown isn't really an issue. Yes, there are areas where slowdown is present, but it's nothing compared to some of the later entries. I also really love the military setting and how the whole game felt like a cohesive package. Whereas later aliens are introduced and the games just got more and more outlandish. Here it's somewhat grounded. Absurd? Absolutely but it just feels as if everything that's going on belongs together, whereas in many of the sequels, things take a strange turn and don't let up. Of all the arcade archives released on the Switch, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One, this one is an absolute must-own. Metal Slug is one of the best 2D video games ever created and looks just as impressive today as it did in 1996. It's also just as fun to play today as it was back in the day. I can't stress this enough. Regardless of the platform you own, purchase this game. It's one of the best.